Hi, my Sunday night film of last week was Jackass Presents Bad Grandpa. On Sunday evenings, I like to watch a movie to ease me back into the week, something light and cheerful, a comedy or a family film. So I chose the previously unseen other Jackass movie. Uh, Johnny Knoxville plays the grandpa in question under heavy prosthetic makeup, who is assigned by his tearaway uh, daughter to take his grandson across country to live with uh, his father, who is himself a bit of an asshole. And along the way, they get into various scrapes and misadventures, which are effectively just an excuse <laughs> for Knoxville and his co-star to get involved in a series of hidden camera pranks on the unsuspecting members of the public. I've always been a big fan of the Jackass series. It's, it meshes rather nicely with my enjoyment of, of highbrow things that I also enjoy Jackass because it's tremendously creative, I think, and original and always coming up with new and bizarre ideas of how these people can injure themselves and each other. Uh, so I was open-minded about seeing uh, a film like this. And I actually really enjoyed it. There's a, a sweetness to it and a, a rather charming relationship story as the uh, the two mismatched characters journey and, and get into these misadventures and play pranks on people, climaxing in a, a scene at a uh, child beauty pageant where the grandson goes in drag and ends up performing a strip of performance <laughs> that his grandfather choreographs from the stalls to everyone else's open-mouthed horror. Um, but it's it's not a film with any great depth, but it does have charm. It does have some creativity in the pranks themselves and in Knoxville's performance, having to act through prosthetics and also ad-lib his way through most of his scenes. Um, it's not a terribly demanding film, and with the Jackass branding, you kind of know what you're going to get. But if the previous work of that team has been enjoyable, then I think you'll enjoy this as well.